Today's social media segment is brought to you by Alford and Associates for all of your insurance needs. CIS, Cardiovascular Institute of the South, the highest quality cardiovascular care available. Barker Honda, the Barker family tradition of quality. Since 1911, the Pierre Parts Store has been your one-stop shop. Family owned and operated for four generations, the Pierre Parts Store has served the community by providing groceries, hardware, home products, and much more, including a full-service lumber yard. Now, we've added the Thibodeau Store to the family with the same values and service we've delivered for over 100 years. The Pierre Parts Store and the Thibodeau Store, our family serving your family. Bayou Time Sports is brought to you by Terrebonne General Health Systems Community Sports Institute in conjunction with Barker Honda. Hello and welcome to this edition of Bayou Time. I'm your host, Keith Weissite, licensed clinical social worker with Terrebonne Home Care. But today, I'm just Uncle Keith. And the reason is because my favorite niece, who my adopted niece, who got to sign with UL is here. And so very, very excited to welcome Claire Ramirez. Claire, thanks for joining us. Very glad that you're here today. I'm so excited. I like it, very good. Sitting next to her is Kayla Vigner. Kayla, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having us. All right, of course, cheer coach and athletic director. And so Claire, one of those things is uh, people kind of get to know you now. I want them to get to know you like I have your whole life. Like for years and years, like swimming was the thing. And most of it was because you were such an outstanding swimmer, oh, right? <laughs> lots and lots of records broken over the years. Uh, but over time, like cheer was also something that was important, right? Mm -hmm. uh, when was it that we kind of made that transition from, from swimming being kind of my main thing to, you know what? I really love cheering and being a, a, mm -hmm. a cheerleader. I really think it was the day that I started cheering oh wow when i started cheering i was co completely fell in love with it right. and i mean i'm not saying that i never felt that love with swimming but cheer was a whole different atmosphere the positivity just the coaching and just everybody being around you it was i don't know it was just yeah. a good switch it's hard to be in a bad mood around a bunch of cheerleaders yes, definitely right definitely and so you find so much positivity versus probably swimming which is kind of that individual thing mm -hmm. like you can be on a team but it's still your individual effort in cheer it's all about the team definitely and and i will mention i know what it's like to be a cheerleader in high school <laughs> and a cheerleader in college claire made me promise to say it and so for me that was one of those things that i, I was the mascot mm -hmm. but the cheer coach at the time allowed me to be part of the team. And so since I was the only the only male there, we got to do pyramids that we wouldn't normally have been able to do since I was there. We got to do double stunts that we weren't necessarily able to do without me kind of being that mascot and cheerleader. And then at Nichols, thanks to my two best friends at the time, T and Teresa, I made the team because I wasn't gonna, mm -hmm. I found out later on. Uh, but that's where it comes from people sticking up for you, right? And being a part of that. So Kayla, let's talk a little bit about when, when it is that you saw Claire as the cheerleader that she is and when you knew that she was really gonna be able to go far with it. Um, I would say probably from the time she stepped on our team, Claire was yeah. always very talented. I knew of Claire prior to her coming on in eighth grade. Yeah. Um, and when she came in as an eighth grader, she had, you know, more talent than majority of the girls that were coming in. Um, and I knew she had it in her. She definitely had the athletic ability. Right. Um, probably, I guess, her sophomore, junior year is when I kind of started to see that she had the determination that I knew we had other girls that were going on to cheer in college. And right. I could see that that aspiring in her to be that that college cheerleader. And um, I would say, you know, that's when she started getting serious about it. And I knew that if she wanted it, I knew she could do it. She yeah. definitely had the ability. She's Claire Amaras. When she puts her mind <laughs> to something, she's going to do it. And that's, listen, that's that's one of those traits. And, and fortunately, she gets that from mom and dad mm -hmm. about those <laughs> things. But so let's show a shot of all of those cheerleaders. So great shot here on signing day. I mean, quite frankly, that echoes exactly what we're talking about, Kayla, exactly what you said, Claire. That's the cheer team. 
That is the Vanderbilt cheer team in support mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. of you signing that yeah. day, right? Yes. Very cool. I love it. So we can't have one big team without considering that home team. Show that next one. Of course, uh, that's Kevin and Laura, uh, Claire's mom and dad. And, uh, of course, both pillars in our community done so very much for Vanderbilt, so much for our community. Uh, but, again, huge support of Claire, a really big deal. And then we get to see her sign, and there she is signing Lefty. Yes. My girl, just like me. Uh, very good. Of course, Coach always so happy. And I say that Coach is in Coach Kevin. Uh, very, very proud of Claire and what she has done and what she's accomplished. And so uh, that signature, tell me what it was like to hear from UL that you got in. It was, I don't know, it was just a completely different mindset of cheer. And it was just, oh my gosh, like I'm going on to college level. And I've always knew that I wanted to cheer in college because I really cannot imagine my life without cheer. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's kind of, it's about who you are, mm -hmm. right? It's who you are inside of you, but it's also who you are as the cheerleader. And so we're very, very excited for you. Uh, anything in particular you're looking forward to? Something that you're really looking forward to to cheering in college, um, but different than, than high school? I'm definitely looking forward to bigger game days. Ooh. And once I, once the UL team welcomed me in to their just their little program, right. the atmosphere, the positivity, like everything. Like I fell in love with cheer all over again. Wow. And reinvested, yes, right? Reinvested, Very cool. I like it. Let's show that next one because I want you to tell me a little bit about your best friend here. Oh, Anna. Yeah. Her. She is my captain and she's also my best friend. Okay. We've been friends since seventh grade. We actually went to different elementary schools, but we clicked first day right. of eighth grade and we've wow. been best friends ever since so. very good and she's moving on to cheer as well she's moving on to a cheer in college so it's exciting yeah no 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 <laughs> she's moving on to lsu yeah, she's with cheer. LSU. She's very good LSU. okay she's very good LSU. well she'll always be a cheerleader because she'll always oh, be course, your cheerleader right she'll always be and so that's a good thing and so what one of those things that we're excited about uh with all of those you all got 10 of mm -hmm. you guys okay. graduating mm -hmm. off of the cheer team and of course graduation is always an exciting time uh Congratulations, Thank first you. and foremost, Thank really you. excited. And I get to walk that path and follow you. But this last thought, share it, if you don't mind, Aaron, the last one. This is Claire saying, I'm going to L, you L, right? Yeah. The Raging Cajuns. That's right, the Raging Cajuns, <laughs> very cool. Um, so very excited for you, Claire. Um, I know that it's been a journey mm -hmm. and it's been an interesting one. Uh, tell me the one, like if there's one word that you're thinking of, that you're looking forward to finishing high school this summer and then moving to college, what would it be? What, one word? One word. If there's one word. Excitement. Just excitement. Definitely. Excitement. Again, dedicated, ready to go, mm -hmm. excited, reinvested. And so I cannot wait to see all the wonderful things you get to do at UL and through Thank cheer. You. So congratulations so for that. Gail, thanks for joining us as Thank well. Thank you for we having appreciate us. it. All right, guys. And that will do it for this particular segment of Bayou Time Sports. Don't go anywhere. A whole lot more local programming right here on HTV.